Here I'm going to show you how to do the uh, sulfate test. So what I've done is I've put some aluminum sulfate into here. And this is my unknown. Uh, in this case I think I used uh, carbonate for my unknown. And I'm going to add barium chloride to each. I'm just going to put a drop of this in there. When I do you can see that precipitate forming. And then likewise in the sulfate I also form a precipitate. So I'm going to mix those up so that we can see our nice, definitely having a precipitate in both. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to add concentrated hydrochloric acid to it. So sulfate will not dissolve when the concentrated hydrochloric acid is added to it. So the barium chloride is insoluble in that acid, even if I add a couple drops. But the other one, hopefully, if I can get a drop there, there we go. You can see that that precipitate has dissolved in the concentrated hydrochloric acid. So here we can see that my unknown does not contain a sulfate. It matched the first part of the test, both formed a precipitate, but the second part with adding the acid, the sulfate, barium sulfate has remained, and in this one the uh, barium carbonate that I formed dissolved in the acid. So that would be a negative result for a sulfate test, and then I would move on to the other one. If these had matched, and this had stayed uh, as a precipitate, then I would have known that I had a sulfate.